The Silk Suite of test automation products has been certified by SAP to support the entire quality management life cycle for SAP environments, including test management, load testing, and functional testing. This demonstration will get you started load testing SAP systems with Silk Performer. First we need to complete some SAP testing prerequisites. Let's begin by running the RZ11 transaction on the SAP server and enabling SAP GUI user scripting. We also need to enable SAP GUI user scripting on the client using the options dialog and disable the other two security settings. We can now create a new project in Silk Performer using the new workflow. We'll give the project a name. And we can now record a script using the model script dialog. The Silk Performer recorder begins and we can select from a list of SAP systems. We'll log into the SAP system and perform some actions that will be recorded. For the purposes of this demonstration, I'll create an appointment in the calendar. We'll give the meeting a name. We'll stop the recorder and save the script. The first thing that must be done is to customize the password. This can be done directly in the script or using the true log. Here I'm hard coding the password directly into the script. And then run a try script run. All of the previously recorded actions will be replayed. We can now view the true log. The true log shows the complete transaction path. In addition to screenshots, details regarding all visible GUI controls are logged. On the control tab, you can see the controls that are highlighted in the rendered part of the screen. Here we'll customize the meeting name and assign a random string of 10 characters. We'll set up a verification function on the time text. And then we'll run another try script. Now let's review the new try script true log. And here we can see that the customization and the verifications were successful. The customized meeting name and also the verification symbol indicate that the verification was successful. Thanks for watching.